Okay, little project I've been working on. A uh, bit of a long story, but brief demo. Here's a five and a quarter inch floppy drive running at 360 RPM, driven by 12 volts external power supply, connected via traditional cable to kind of a special device. This is a USB based external three and a half inch floppy drive. This has a controller chip on it, which includes USB and a floppy drive controller. So I think you can see where I'm going with this. I'm going to connect that to the computer via USB. Drive is going to be detected. And there is three and a half inch, or at least Windows thinks, floppy drive A. Let's see what's on it. And that's right. Just read the contents of the disk, and then just for fun, I will copy some files to it. Now, I've done a terrible thing to make this work, because that floppy disk is actually formatted at 1.44 megabytes, um, 80 tracks and 15 sectors per track. The reason is because that when formatted at 1.2 megabytes, Windows XP will not show the contents of the disk, or doesn't seem to read the disk. So, this is a start. But if I can figure out a way to keep a 1.2 formatted disk and have it work under Windows, that would really be the icing on the cake.